Well, guys, we should now be live here uh, for the first stream of the surge, which um, I'll be explaining what it is in a second as soon as a few people get in here, I guess. Right. Hey, UK, welcome back to the stream. Yeah, so the surge. Uh, it's an upcoming game which comes out in about, I don't know, a week or something. And it's kind of got a bit of similarities to Dark Souls. So, I thought it would be cool to stream it. Um, well, yeah, it's kind of a, uh, a, blah, <laughs> a review copy, so I got it a bit early. So, I'm allowed to stream it anyway. So, um, I played it a very tiny bit. I didn't even get to the first boss, but I just want to check it out... Um, a bit before streaming that seems cool enough it's got a few different mechanics from dark souls but you get the dark souls feeling all right so yeah let's uh let's go no it's not made by from software but it is well you see it's it's quite a similar so we're gonna go and start a new game anyway i may as well even overwrite this for uh, this uh practice character that i did so and like Dark Souls, this is an action RPG. It's got the difficulty from Dark Souls. Um, but there are a few different things that will that will obviously make it different from Dark Souls. Hey Metodi, how's it going? Uh, yeah, so it's kind of like a an action RPG with the so some of the Souls mechanics. It's very hard, well, it's just as hard as Dark Souls anyway, I think. And... Um, yeah, let's check it out. I haven't played it too much myself, so we'll see. So obviously, I don't know, really. The story seems like one of those typical stories where machines kind of take over the world or this, this big company that reckons that it will bring the world back to its former glory, but everything goes wrong, pretty much. Hey, Nightmare Terror. Yeah, this is uh, the Surge that we'll be releasing next week. Um, hey Perry the Platypus. No, this isn't the one from uh, from software. That that we don't know anything really about that yet. But hopefully we'll play. If this game's decent enough, we'll play it all the way through. Uh, the uh, the pre or the alpha demo wasn't too. I mean, not as it wasn't too good. It just wasn't optimized all that well. But now it should be hopefully a bit better. Hey the great cat ski, how's it going man? Welcome to the stream. So the graphics on this do seem quite a bit better than Dark Souls, I gotta admit. Though that's not really that important. But well maybe not this part. But um yeah, so we're gonna go and join up to this this company that's supposedly gonna bring the world back to its former glory called Creo. And yeah, with this dude, and you'll see, you see the reason in a second. But yeah, we can look around. There's all tutorial stuff. You don't really get much of a tutorial on this game, but yeah, that's true. This is from the same devs that made Lord of the Fallen. That's it. I knew they made another game, but I just couldn't remember what one it was. That's good to hear. The Great Katsuki. It's I, I, it's not such a well-known game, though it's only got a week left to come out, but it definitely seems like if you're a Souls fan, you may get some uh, joy out of this. No, this is this is from the uh, developers for Lords of the Fallen, I think. But it's it doesn't feel anything like the Lords of the Fallen. It's, it's, it's nowhere near as uh, slow as Lords of the Fallen. It's... Oh, look inverted, no. It's kind of, it feels a bit more like Bloodborne, the movement does, like the uh, fast dodges. So, uh, we're actually in a wheelchair here, um, which is uh, quite unexpected. But uh, the reason for that is because we're going to try and join this Creo, which pretty much can heal that and give you an exosuit. So that's why, I th I'm pretty sure that's why we're interested in joining. Uh, no, it's not a shooting game, it's an arcade. It's actually got less ranged combat than uh, Dark Souls. It's got like very very few things that you can do ranged. It's an action RPG. It feels very Bloodborne-ish at times. Not the uh, environment obviously but I meant the movement. It's quite quick. 
So, yeah, kind of. Yeah, this guy's going to become kind of a super soldier, yeah. Right, so, um, here at the start we get to choose uh, in between two classes. We get to choose the Rhino class, which is obviously more of a brute, uh, slower paced class. And then we've got the Lynx, which is kind of a versatile, agile kind of character. So when I tried it out uh, before for a few minutes, I played with the Rhino and it seems, you know, okay. So this time I'm going to... I'm going to try with the Lynx, because even the movement with the Rhino is really quick, it felt like Bloodborne, so I'm guessing this guy just gets more of a, a faster weapon or something like that. Yeah, we're going with the Lynx this time. Like I said, I played uh, very little, didn't even get to the first boss. Alright, so this is kind of a bit unexpected, how they implement the exosuit. But, to be honest, he, he can't walk, so I guess it's kind of worth it, if he can walk after this. Oh, that one's got to hurt. I mean, the one just here, maybe not so much, but that one will. Yeah, I prefer speed over tankiness. The reason I got the Rhino uh, first go because I wanted to try them both because, uh, and I wanted to use the links as the live stream. So, well, we are a super soldier. Um, hey Chippy Palm over there on Twitch. How's it going, mate? I got the uh, Twitch chat over here. I wish there was like a way to combine both chats from Twitch and YouTube. Okay, so and he got like I'm not sure if it's really unlucky, but his power core or his core power system is actually like badly done or it's it's screwed over. So he have to get a new power core. So it's like all that shit for a dodgy power core. Hey Cody, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Glad you're good, uh, Chippy Palm over there on, on Twitch. Right, so at least now we can walk. So for the most part, it's very um, Dark Soulish, the movements and stuff. His hollow. <laughs> right, so obviously we've got, we're setting a more futuristic. Um, environment so we've got our resters over there on circle we've got weak attacks we've got strong attacks though this weapon is pretty fast i am noticing that we start with the same weapon on uh links as we did when we was a rhino we can run but when it, when it comes to dodging it feels like a lot more like bloodborne ish because you dodge so much quicker than uh on dark souls it's quite hard to jump. The jumping is really weird on this game. Come here then, mate. Okay. Do you reckon Dark Souls 3 graphics are better? I don't know. It's hard to tell, really. Stamina goes so fast in this game. And our health is got pretty good. Pretty fast as well. Right, um... I'm pretty sure there's like some like well hidden items around here, kind of like Dark Soulish style. Yeah, there's one of them. So this is a this is a small pile of material scrap. So this is like the souls you pick up to then uh, burst them and get the souls into your inventory. No, we're we're talking on YouTube as well. That's why if if you if you find out that. I'm, or if you see that I'm saying something that doesn't really make sense, I'm probably talking to the other chat. Um, I'm more of a dex build, I guess. Um, Dark Souls, Hard and Dark Souls. I'm not really sure if Dark Souls 1's Hard and Dark Souls 3. The thing is, Dark Souls 3 feels easier, but it's probably because I, I already had so much experience from the other games, if you know what I mean. Because when, when Dark Souls 1 came out, you don't really have much experience, maybe just from Demon Souls. That's probably why it feels easy. Alright, I knew there's an item around here somewhere. Right. So we're going to get a lot of material to like upgrade and build stuff. Oh. 
Right, I can never get that attack to work. So if you run and then weak attack, you like slide, but it's a bit weird. Looks like it will go in my next pay. <laughs> well, we'll see what it's like. I mean, so far it seems pretty, pretty good. All right, um, down here I think there's some optional items. Got to be careful, these guys. These guys actually do some damage if they hit you. Stamina goes so bloody fast. Oh shit! Look at my health go. Holy moly! At least, at least you can move. Um. Well, healing like healing's instantaneous. Like even faster than on uh, Bloodborne. You know, you don't even really uh, see an action or anything. You just press it and it happens. These guys got some health. I think people need to stop shouting over there on the streets. How much health did this guy get? I mean, come on. Finally. I only got one Estus left, or potion, or whatever. These guys have got some health. Right, so uh, you probably realize that we can't see the enemy's health bar at the moment, but we will get uh, <clears throat> a passive chip that we can equip for that. Um, this is for PS4. And it's not a beta and it's not an alpha, this is the uh, full game. Hey Quilo. Uh Thanks for the follow over there on Twitch. Right, so what do we get? Um, processor. Okay. Yeah, the exosuit, there, there is a lot better exosuits and there are some that look really, really cool. But yeah, this one doesn't look all that great. Uh, this game does seem hard, especially at the start anyway. But we'll see. I haven't, I haven't actually found a boss yet. So, that'll be interesting, see what the bosses are like. Um, right, Rocket Yard. I think there's an item around here. I like... I like the exploration is fairly... Oh no, wait, I've already been here. The exploration and the optional items do seem very Dark Soul-ish, like, as in exploration-wise, at least. Just making sure we're not really missing much. Um, what's down here? Block attacks. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm meant to be going this way yet. So, I really don't like the way it jumps though. It's really weird. You, like you hold down the run. It's kind of like Dark Souls, I guess. You run, hold down the run button, and then press jump. Don't like it on this game at all though. Oh, these ones are the weak ones, okay. They look very similar to the really resistant ones, but these guys die in, like, two hits. Hey, somehow, how's it going, mate? Welcome to the stream. Right, so we got an implant here. I'm not sure, can we actually, um, right. So implants are basically, like, passives that we can equip on the suit. So as you can see, there's, like, four at the moment, and then we'll have eight uh, when we go leveling up. So at the moment, we've got um, the Estes equipped, pretty much, which are the potions. So let's go and equip the one we just got, which is the uh, one to see the enemy's health bars. So, um, I do believe enemies spawn when you die and they even uh, respawn when you rest at a med bay, which is uh, the equivalent to a bonfire. So yeah, they do respawn. Or at least I'm 99% sure they do. Alright, so like we said before, our power core is defective, so we've got to go and get a new one before being able to do pretty much anything, so. Hello there. Hello. Uh, they, we don't really have to listen, it's pretty much just explaining a bit of what's going on, I guess. Right, um. So we're interested to craft items, we can't really do any of that yet because we're still got a defective power core. Yeah, they're not, they're not bonfires there, are. Uh, so why would the fuck that place was okay? So these are just audio logs, which are like the collectibles. Hey, Mr. Peace, how's it going? It's like Dark Souls in a lot of ways, but it's also different to Dark Souls in some other ways. Start is very Dark Soulish, as in the movement, the difficulty, uh, and the combat in general. Though, as you can see, this one of the main differences are from Dark Souls is that you actually get to. Uh, aim what plate, what part of the body you want to hit, and basically we're going for the head now because that's not going to be armor on. But say we wanted uh, some leg pieces to build another weapon, 
then we would have to take out the leg first <coughs> or kill him by uh, taking out the leg and we will, we should get a piece for whatever weapon uh, we're looking for or leg piece in that case yeah this this is kind of like a sci-fi duck so it's really it's like more futuristic so right we're looking for the unarmed part of his body and we can tell uh, which which parts are armed um, or armoured by the little uh, yellow shield so we're gonna go for the head obviously we do more damage but then we we don't really get anything from killing him but okay and then if we wanted like the weapon then we gotta like uh, aim for his weapon hand obviously no, I don't th I'm not I think there is a way to backstab in this game but I'm not too sure how it works yet all right so let's go and get this guy's weapon if possible Though it is obviously a bit slower. I'm not sure if we can get it from this guy. Let's try anyway. Then there's also another energy system that uh, we haven't actually got at the moment. It'll give us give it to us in a second. I'm not sure if we're going to be... I don't think we can actually uh, get his weapon without having this energy system I'm talking about. Hey DMG, glad to see you too mate. Right, so, right, yeah, we can't get his weapon yet, I don't think, though, oh, we did get, oh, right, yeah, there's the, the um, there's the, the new power core that, uh, we have to get to fix, or swap for our, our defective one. Equilag, does each body part have a separate HP bar? Uh, no, I don't think they do, actually, I think, like, it, it still affects the main enemy's HP bar. But just depending on what part you kill him with, I think. Like, I could be wrong, but we'll check it out in a second. But I think depending on what part you kill him with, then you get that um, part as a like a body part or a part for crafting. All right, so this is where we can level up. So we obviously need nearly 400 to level up, but we've got 700. So we're just going to go and level up once. Uh, if we press triangle, then we like... Um, burst all the scrap pieces or the souls that we had in items so we're just gonna go ahead and do that we still don't have enough so that's a bit pointless so we're just leveled up um yeah we can't really do much there's no well i'm not sure about stats yeah to be honest i haven't got that far but i don't think so the thing is there's not stats but um i don't want this is not important but though there's not stats so for each level okay yes yeah, so we just got we got the blueprints. Actually, I'm not sure if we've even got these. Right, let's just check out. Um, there's inventory, implants, gear. So yeah, this is like the very um, yeah, this is like the really shitty ones. But as you can see in each item, so uh, down bottom it says core power consumption, and it says two. So for each level we go up, uh, we get uh. A maximum core power consumption so as you can see at the bottom it says 5 at 11 so that obviously means we're on level 11 and depending on what items we're on equipped the more the better ones will obviously take up uh, more slots so we got to level up and then equipped uh, more things if you know what I mean so there's no stats but that's what the point of leveling up is um, inventory so yeah so we just got some blueprints so if we go over here to gear assembly so we've got well we actually already got that but if we wanted the we probably already got this as well but just just for an example so we'd need tech scrap which is like souls and then we would need um the part of the leg which we would get by killing somebody by destroying the leg and the way you do that <clears throat> is now we have got a third bar which is a blue bar Right, uh, is this going to be on Xbox? I believe it will be, I think. Um, all three platforms, yeah. So this game has two classes. I think it's only got two classes from what I've seen, which is... Oh, fuck. <laughs> Holy shit. Right, so now we've got the blue bar. So what we want to do is we want to charge up. And as you can see now, uh, after it's passed that saw, that means we can chop a limb off. So let's try and chop his leg off. Obviously the armored leg. Well, they're both armored in this case. And when it's on low health, we're just gonna hold square. Oh, we're gonna hold square, and now we're gonna chop it off with using our energy bar. And this is going to give us um, 
yeah, a leg piece. So we've got our wrecked Lynx leg gear, which we can then use to craft different leg pieces. A Solera Restorer. So this is basically like a sci-fi Dark Souls to a certain degree anyway. All right, so let's try and get this guy's weapon. I think we should be able to get it now. All right, so. Now. We should, if we cut off his weapon arm, we should technically get that weapon. Um, so far, I like this quite a bit better than the Lords of the Fallen. Oh, no, we didn't. We got. Oh, yeah, we did. Yeah, we did. We got his weapon. So far, I think that um, Lords of the Fallen is too slow for my taste, and this is better. At least so far. All right, so, yeah, we got another weapon. So, it's got more damage. Energy gain. So we're not going to get as much energy, but it does scale better. I'm not too sure what that means at the moment, but we're going to use this. It definitely seems, okay, it seems very fast as well, which is good for our Lynx class. Yeah, um, yeah, the boss, I mean, sorry, the uh, specific body parts are really what, really the main difference from Dark Souls. But really, you... Like, I think the the body parts are more like just to get weapons or body parts, specific body parts to craft. But I think you could pretty much just play it as a Dark Souls if you're not interested in that. Obviously, it is important to a certain degree. Right, so technically, we, as you can see, the number 10 there, we had to be level 10 to open that. If not, we wouldn't be able to overpower it, so you'd have to sit there farming, but obviously, that's not the case. Right, so, right, we can get this weapon if we want, but obviously cutting off that arm but I don't really want it because it's a bit slow for the Lynx class anyway I mean for the Rhino class it seems pretty good but we're gonna get it anyway but it's gonna be far too slow for this class there. right um, it's gonna show it to you guys so it's actually a lot stronger but it's a lot slower too It's definitely so much slower, and th these are the fast attacks. So you can charge these uh, the more uh, weak attacks up as well. Praise the sun. Okay, praise the sun. Small pile of metal scrap. So that's pretty much just like souls. Right, let's go and put our, our faster weapon back on. And I think we had some left gear. Oh, sorry, leg gear. Right, so we got right and left. So, uh, right, we only had one, so we can't equip it to both sides, which is a shame. So I think we had to go over here somewhere. That's definitely... Oops. It's jumping so weird on this game. You actually jump really far, but... Oh, hello there. We can defend, obviously, with L1, but you can't actually move while you're defending, which is a bit weird. Fuck that damage. Really be careful with these guys. The damage on these guys, like they're really slow, but if they hit you, yours. Yeah, look at that damage. And we're still like at the start of the game. Oops. Oh shit. Oh, did I die? Yeah, I died. Wow, that damage. Holy crap. Wow. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not saying that Dark Souls jumping was amazing. <laughs> Dark Souls jumping was really bad as well. Wow, well, we just got destroyed by that guy. And yeah, I think yeah, all the enemies respawn. I actually got um a bit further with the Rhino class, and we didn't die that early on. So yeah, so oh yeah, there's something a slightly different. So we obviously lose our tech scrap, which is like souls, and we obviously have to go and pick it up, but. Uh, we have a time. As you can see on the on the right hand side of the screen, we've got um, two minutes to go and pick it up. If not, it will disappear. And I believe if we kill enemies on the way, we actually get bonus uh, tech scrap from them, which is pretty cool. Alright, okay, we'll pick this up. I'm gonna go and get uh, my scrap, which is over 
here. Guarded by that guy. Hopefully he won't kill us again. Oh, that second attack. Oh, let's go and kill him then. Alright, we got his um, headgear, so we should... Wow, that is so similar to our... Oh, no, we didn't. Okay, it's like scrap, so we have to... Um... We have to... Actually, oh, shit. We actually have to craft it. So what we just leveled up is like single-handed weapon profi proficiency and as you see um, when we change weapon, each weapon has like a low, high or whatever uh, scaling. So that's what that means. So obviously a weapon can benefit from that more or less. Holy, wow, that damage is absolutely done. We just got another schematic, which is good. This weapon is actually pretty good. But like in like later on in this game, there is actually some really really cool uh, armor sets and stuff like that. Not this this shitty one. Uh, it has crafting, but it's not quite like Neo. But crafting is quite a big part of this game. Um, I guess they're like hollows. Yeah, I mean I'm not really sure what the later enemies are like. I haven't really seen much of it. But um, yeah, these guys seem a bit like out a bit zombie like. As you can see, like they don't really know what what they're trying to hit. Pretty sick wood. Right. Um. Um. Right. So to activate this, we had to take an elevator, which was around here somewhere. Yeah. Okay. So we had to be level eleven to d uh, activate this, uh, which we are. I believe we're exactly level eleven. Could probably level up by now, but I don't. Th I'm not sure if it's massive farming like near. Uh, can we jump up here? Yeah. Jumping is fucking weird. So this is an alloy, which is a pretty rare item, I believe. Anyway, oh, um, another one. Okay, maybe they're not that rare. Fuck you, game. As soon as I pick one up, you know. Oh, so this is actually a shortcut back, I think. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, or no, there's obviously not the right place. Okay, so we've got another implant, which are like the passives. So let's go and see if we can equip that. Um. So we we can I think we can no we can't why can't we equip the injectable that restores health oh no is this the one already got equipped it huh oh I see we can't equip it because um we haven't got I know we do have enough power core power I'm not quite sure why we can't equip this one see if he was high injectable restore Oh no, wait. Oh, okay, sorry, my bad. What am I talking about? That's the one that was always uh, equipped, which is the uh, the Estes flasks. So what do we just pick up? One of these. Um, display enemy health. and s Okay, so the one we just picked up is slows energy decay. So okay, that's pretty good. The character is not customized. So, um, you can't customize the character now. Which is a bit of a sad thing. But Has he got any part... Holy god, that damage from these little guys are bloody annoying as hell. And they actually survived like quite a lot compared to like the enemies at the start of uh, Dark Souls. Uh, no, you you can't dual wield a one-handed weapon, though there is there are two-handed weapons um, that you can pick up. Uh, so this is definitely the shortcut, I believe. Uh, yeah, this is going to be the shortcut back to the, uh, the, um, well, I can't remember the name of these. It's just call them bonfires. It's, um, med bay. Okay. That's what they're called. So, yeah, we can level up at least twice, I'm guessing. Three times. I don't really want to use them all because, let's see what we can do over here. So, uh, we can actually build another one of these for our other arm, I guess. So, 
fair, fair enough. And can't build that. I'm gonna build another one for our. Can we not? Oh, we don't have enough uh, scrap. But we did build one for our left arm. Right. Okay. Should be good so far. Okay. Um. No, we don't have another one. Okay. Can't really do much at the moment. Right. <clears throat> Let's continue. Let's see if we can at least get to a first boss. Is this even the right way? <laughs> Jesus Christ, these guys survive so much. You need patience on this game. All the way from the start. Oh, that, that combo, I didn't know that. Okay, okay no, this isn't the door. Where, where the hell is the door that we came from? Oh, we can... There's a lift here, I didn't know that. I think I know where it's going to take us, though, because there's an item in that last room up high. Small pile of um, rare materials. Anything else? I'm not sure about full damage on this game at the moment. Oh, fuck. Wrong button. Didn't take full damage from that, anyway. Yeah, I'm quite curious to see what the boss battles are going to be like, too, to be honest. Come on, then, dude. I, I like the dodging. It really does remind me of Bloodborne. Just like the quick slides to the side. Really cool. Uh, do not guarantee that the cart will be successful. Okay, so... Uh, the... Okay, okay, I didn't know that. So, yeah, if we want the cart to be successful, we have to do most of our attacks on that part. So I'm guessing like if at the last moment we change part and do damage to another part and then cut off a different part, then it's not going to be as likely to cut off. No, this is the full version. Hey Dash, what's up? Um, yeah, we're going to be playing Bloodborne. I'm not sure, maybe, t maybe, if I can, maybe later today we'll start Bloodborne. But I want to... Like, this is kind of like a Dark Souls game, so I, I would like to completely upload this to the channel, which would be pretty cool. I'm actually quite curious of how this game's going to play out. Like, if for whatever reason, then afterwards I get bored of it, or well, then obviously we're not, but... But for now, this game seems like it could be quite interesting. Like, obviously... Oh, fuck. Like, obviously we're at the tutorial still, and I've already died once, so... Oh, my God. Oh, shit, that second attack got me last time. I'm just cutting off random pieces. I'm not actually, um, okay, okay. We're getting our one handed up quite uh, fast. Can we actually see anything like that? Like a proficiency, specs, 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 specs. One handed over there. Okay, good. And a hundred percent walkthrough for this. I don't know. Depends what it's like, to be honest. Once I get through the whole thing, if I, and I find like it's worth it. Then yeah, though the, um, I'm not going to lie, the item explorations do seem very similar to the uh, Soul series at the moment. I'm not going to lie, that I like it a lot. Like how they're just uh, slightly hit, well they're not slightly hidden, some are actually quite well hidden. Like there's loads of optional little paths and shortcuts that I really do like. Yeah, this is the full version, yeah. I think it's like, it comes out next week, I think. 16th. Uh, okay. Right, so let's continue. See. Well, technically, I mean, I know this is kind of like a tutorial, but it doesn't seem like a tutorial. I mean, they are kind of explaining shit to you, but... Not as... Oh, wow, that was so lucky. Look at that damage, though. That's ridiculous. I've got a feeling this may even be harder than some of the Souls games. Yeah, the damage you take from enemies is absurd sometimes. Wow, my. Oh, no. I oh, fucking hell. Alright, I'm out of here, guys. No potions left for this. Oh, my God. I'd say I'm screwed. Yeah, that's. I wanted that item. I can't find a way out to get that item. It's 
probably a bad idea here. I'm guessing I'm not in mortal while doing this. Okay, they didn't actually hit me. Yeah, I'm dead. Wow. They do do a lot of damage. I'm not gonna lie, and there's like three or four of them at once. Bloody hell. Okay, at least we activated that shortcut anyway. Yeah, it, it does, like, it starts off really, really fucking high, the damage. I mean, they could have started off with a bit less and then gradually increased, kind of like Dark Souls. They just, they just destroy you. Like, look at my health already by, like, one or two hits from these little guys. Right, okay. Uh, what's in this way again? I'm guessing that's going to be another shortcut a bit later on. What I would like to see if, if the uh, the worlds are interconnected that well would be pretty cool. I don't think it's going to be that interconnected like on Dark Souls, but... Stamina goes rather fast as well. Oh yeah, we can backstab. Nice. Oh, that's pretty sick, actually. Okay. That's that's cool. That's... I'm guessing it's not just going to let me backstab whenever I want. No. Ah, oh, backstab. Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Feels really good. Uh, yeah, it's coming out in about four days. It's kind of like a Dark Souls sci-fi game. Oh, I really want to backstab everything now. <laughs> I really like that. It's really cool. I mean, we still get, like... Oh, wow. If that would have hit me, I would have probably died. Uh, no, it's not a beta version. It is the full game. <clears throat> right, um... So I, I, I want to run through, but I don't want to run through. I wonder if... We, it doesn't look like we may not be in mortal. I'll uh, have some nice iframes when we backstab. Could be wrong, though. It seems like it may be... You have to be a bit more precise than on Dark Souls to backstab on this game. Holy crap. Oh, my God. Oh, fuck me. Already out of Esther's. They hit so hard at the start. Okay. Uh, I don't know if you can parry. Like, I th I'm i not sure if you... I'm guessing you probably get, like, some kind of a shield weapon. Probably not the best time to look. I'm guessing it depends on your weapon. But I'm not sure if there's any, like, uh... Anything like parrying on this game. I'm not sure. It's good that we can backstab, though. But we'll see. Oh god, I thought it was too alive. That made me jump. He's dead. Oh my god, that was scary. Right, so it looks like we do get some potions back when we kill enemies, which is good. Uh, yeah, it seems pretty good so far. Oh my god, it's very. It seems very hard at the start. But like, this is literally still a tutorial kind of level, and we're getting. We already died like twice, I think. Ah, oh, I didn't get the back stuff. So yeah, so this is from the developers from Lords of the Fallen, but it feels nothing like Lords of the Fallen, which is, in my opinion, a good thing anyway. Yeah, I'm actually really interested in finding a boss myself, I'm not going to lie. Alright, getting that one-handed up nicely. I'm not sure if... Oh, fuck. This is where we died last time. Let's, let's try and bait this one out before the other guy comes charging down the road. Alright, hopefully this one guy should be on his own. Fucking idiot, man. How do I not dodge that? That damage is so ridiculous. Right, come on. I mean, these guys are, should be pretty easy to dodge anyway. Oh my god, that second attack gets me every time. That damage is ridiculous, like, honestly. Like, the Dark Souls at the start is nothing compared to this. Wow. I'm going to try and run past a few of them to see. We've got like a thousand scrap there, which is quite a lot, so... What was that shortcut? Why am I just ignoring the shortcut? I keep forgetting about the shortcut, actually. 
Right. Hey Tobias, uh, welcome to the stream. So this is uh, the Surge, which is about to release in uh, four days, I believe. Right, we got our scrap back, and it's very s it's similar in a lot of ways to Dark Souls, but obviously a more futuristic kind of version. Right, um, I'm gonna just run past these guys because I'm gonna get destroyed again. Right, what's this? Is this like a shortcut? This is, yeah, this is the shortcut back to the med, whatever the fuck called. We're actually going to go back there because we should be able to level up. Yeah, it's releasing on the 16th, that's true. I believe for all three platforms. I'm currently playing on the PS4 version though. Right, med bay. Let's level up. Um, let's bank. Whatever we have, we still can't. Okay, what did it say? It said Exo Sue or Exo Rigis. Um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what this is to be honest. I guess this keeps leveling up or something. We don't have any more blueprints, so I think we're just going to carry on. It is by the uh, same developers as Lords of the Fallen, but it definitely feels a lot more bloodborne ish, the movement. Like, Lords of the Fallen is way too... I didn't actually like it too much because of the movement. Really slow and sluggish, but this is actually a lot more fluent and it feels a lot more like Bloodborne dodging. Yeah, we'll, we'll see. I mean, things may change a lot. We'll, like, there's literally the tutorial area. Alright, so we've got a nice shortcut, so it makes sense if there's a boss now. Because this tutorial is getting rather long. Is this going to kill me? This seems like a bit of a secret area. Oh, hello. That's probably a boss battle. Let's just chill for a second. Am I going to go and kill that? Is that like a mini boss, maybe? Hey, one, two, three, six. How's it going? Right, um. I'm guessing this is a boss. These guys are actually pretty annoying as well. Is this a mini boss or a boss? Oh, hello. Well, that silenced me. I can't attack when that happens. I think. Oh. What the? F <laughs> that one shot. Oh my god. I'm guessing that's probably not meant to be the boss we're facing at the moment. Holy. Yeah, there's the full version. Oh my god. Holy shit, that damage. Right, we're not going that way. We're not going that way. I'm guessing that's like one of those really, well, not even Dark Souls kind of tutorial bosses, really. That's just, that's clearly an optional boss, I mean. That's just, that's just out of order. So we're not going to have our souls or whatever they're called. Right, I'm just going to try and pick him up and get the fuck out of there. Right. Are we getting poisoned by this? I don't think so. It really depends what kind of game you're looking for. Or if you should like uh, fighting games more than Injustice. It's already going to be better. But if you're into Dark Souls, I wouldn't say this. Well, I don't know. I can't really talk that much because we're literally in the tutorial area. Well, when they um, when they electrocute you, it actually stops you from attacking for a while. But this doesn't seem as bad as stuff like Lords of the Fallen. And uh, so far I'm enjoying it. Like, I mean, it would be good if in the in the later stages, like the environment maybe changes a bit. So it's not as boring. But, but I know that you can get some very cool uh, armors, armor set after, like a bit later on. Yeah, that one shot is just ridiculous. That was. Is that the first boss? Like, honestly, the first boss. That's ridiculous. I'm guessing that maybe was his, like, ultimate kind of attack that maybe it's meant to kill you. Okay, Nightmare Terror. At least these guys don't do any damage compared to somebody over there. But yeah, it does look like that could be the first boss. I mean, this, can we go this way? Alright, there's an item over here. New implant. Alright, let's see what this implant is. 
Um, is this it? Yeah. Why can't we use it? Do we not have like enough energy? Okay, we don't have energy for whatever the hell that means. But okay. I'm guessing we just gotta level up more to have more energy. Is that honestly the first boss? That would be interesting, at least. Alright, go on then, mate. Dude, no, that's clearly not that. I'm not. I'm not believing that. I'm not. Oh, I'm getting the fuck out of it. I'm getting froze. I'm getting everything. I'm not believing that this guy is the first boss. Okay, maybe that damage isn't too bad. We're getting froze, and we can't even dodge when we're froze, which is a bit annoying. Okay. Maybe he's like, he does extremely a lot of damage, but maybe he's very slow. But yeah, that definitely one shot me last time. Okay, it didn't quite. Wow, well, I think I was missing a bit of health, but still, that's still ridiculous damage. Okay, l luckily his health isn't that huge. Oh shit, we're froze. Uh, there are ranged attacks, not that many though. There's like you get a drone afterwards, I believe. But it's nowhere near as much range as like Dark Souls. So we're actually doing alright here. Get out of that shit. Ah, uh, it's like when I'm in this, my stamina doesn't recharge. Oh, oh, fuck. No. Oh, I'm still alive, thank God for that. I'm doing too much damage at the moment, though. Sometimes it doesn't damage him. Ah, oh, I think I gotta hit him in there. No, wait, why? So why, oh, is this a parry? Or, no. <laughs> oh, I thought he went down for like a rip, repost or something, but obviously not, he just killed me. But I don't think this, I don't think this is like a proper boss because I'm sure the the bosses get like a proper health bar, like on Dark Souls, I think anyway. Yeah, I, I thought it was optional, but I think we should probably kill it now, I've seen what it's like. Hey Gagawell, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. And we're going to die against these little guys, so that's probably not cool. There we go. Okay, should we go after him again? Well, we'll try one more time, just to see. Oh crap, what was that? Oh, not this guy. Get out of the way. Ah, oh, no, he's bloody silenced me. Is that doing damage though? Because last time it didn't seem like everything. Oh, I'm dead now. Fuck that. Right, we're not going to try him anymore. It's just ridiculous damage. It like, doesn't seem all that hard if you dodge, I guess, but we've got better things to do. Hopefully, we'll be able to come back later on, so. Alright, let's go and find the first boss. Yeah, I think that's what it's like. A bit of a buff version of the Crystal Lizard, but yeah. I'd say it's something like that. I don't know, because I'm pretty sure the bosses... Um, I could be wrong, but I'm sure the bosses had like their own unique boss bar, like uh, Dark Souls. But, uh, okay, there is some stairs over here. Okay, good. Right, let's just hope the boss is this way. I'm trying to look out, see if anybody's got. I mean, I wonder if because you can obviously upgrade the weapons on this game. But I'm not sure how. Well, I know how, but I'm not sure what you need though.
Uh, no, it's not free. It's it's not even out yet, so I'm not sure what the price is exactly. But it's a it's a full triple A game, so it'll probably be the full sixty dollars. I'm guessing. But um, I think it comes out in about four days. So right, where are we? Yeah, I was thinking like hippo enemies, yeah. But you know, it's, it's similar to the crystal lizard guys as well, yeah. Oh, oh, I hate that crap. Oh, okay. I think we get in iframes frames when we're dodging, so that's pretty good. Um, no, I never actually played uh, Diablo. No, I hear it's very good. But I think it's one of those games that you have to dedicate quite a lot of time to. Right. Um, worth the full sixty dollars? Well, to be honest, we'll see. I don't know. Like we're still in the tutorial area, and this is completely blind for me. So we'll see as we go. I guess it seems decent for now, anyway. Like it's definitely better than Lords of the Fallen. Right. Where are we? Uh, I don't know if there is a demo. I don't think there's a demo. This is the full version of the game. Right, is this... We do a shortcut. Oh, there's not a shortcut. Um, guess we'll... I don't know. Where do we go? Uh, wait, one second. I just want to see if there's a shortcut or something. Right. Hey Nightmare Terror, welcome back. Is this this looks like a shortcut? Normally the yellow doors are shortcuts, but I could be wrong. Oh, hello, this is not a shortcut. Oh my god. Jesus Christ, dude. Is he gonna do a second attack? Yeah, it's that second attack that gets me every bloody time. Doing some nice damage anyway. Hey Abraham, how's it going? Uh, no, well, this is on. Um, I mean, the game is coming out for PC, but this is the uh, PS4 version. Yep, traps like Dark Souls, that is true. Alright, we're in the plow a power plant. Is that a new weapon? I don't think so. It's hard to tell. But I don't really. We're not interested in weapons unless they're like uh, fast weapons, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, fuck. <clears throat> okay. Uh, I think we're... Yeah, okay, we can get that. Um, yeah, uh, the PC specs I got maybe not be the best in the world, but they can definitely play pretty much any game at 60 FPS with pretty much ultra graphics. Right, uh, so is, is this a dead end? Well, there's a door here we can't open for whatever reason. Can we go down? Uh not sure if I like this though. I was actually going to run out of time to pick up our uh, scrap, which was like the optional boss, but. Um, yeah, we don't really care. Uh, do we get lights? Okay, we don't have body gear anyway though, do we? No. Are we meant to have body gear by now? Because it's rather dark down here. Um Right, let's 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 backtrack a bit. I'm not sure if we we're meant to go down there yet. What about up? Hmm. Oh wait. This door just opened, huh? I'm guessing it was this guy who opened it. We couldn't open it, so that's weird. Oh fuck you. You can clearly tell the damage boost when we're attacking a uh, body part without any armor on. What do we just pick up? Oh, alloys, okay. This is a lift. Right. I'm not sure where we are at the moment. I'm not sure if we're advancing, we're heading back. It looks like we're advancing, I guess. 
Uh, what do we think about the game? It seems alright so far. Well, we're still on the tutorial level. We haven't fought a boss yet. So it's hard to tell. It definitely seems hard. The damage on the enemies is just ridiculous at the moment. Um, yeah, definitely better than Lords of the Fallen at the moment. Um, right. Where do we go? Do we go that way or... Oh wait, this is... I think we can get the item that I've seen. Is this the same room? I'm not even sure if it's the same room or not. Right. New implant. Okay. Increase the amount of energy gained through successful attacks. Okay, I'm not sure what that means exactly, but yeah. Um... Code vein, I'm not even sure what that is to be honest. Is code vein meant to be an upcoming game or something? I'll check it out later on if it seems interesting. Oh look at oh shit. Oh those weapons look awesome. And for a fast build I want those weapons. Hopefully we can get him off him. An anime Dark Souls game. Oh, that seems interesting. Hey Valerie, how's it going? So there's also a game that I uh, just released, which I hopefully may be able to live stream one of these days, called um, Dead Cell. So um, yeah, it seems very interesting. All right, we'll all be back here. How fast can we get back to the other area? I don't think we opened any shortcuts as well. Run for it. It's like thousand texos over there I'll check uh, code vein out after once I finish actually but when is it not releasing soon I guess if there's only a trailer oh, okay. oh wait no I got hit what the fuck <laughs> bad idea then I'm just gonna run for it at the moment I want my souls back or tech scrap or whatever you want to call them yeah, Dead Souls looks really good. I haven't had the chance to play it yet, but I really do. Uh, so far, it seems pretty good. Um, it definitely seems... Where are my cells, or whatever the fuck called oh, up here, I think. <laughs> it seems good so far. But like I said, we're still in the tutorial. Kind of, if you can call it a tutorial. We haven't found a boss yet. We've only found like a mini boss. Which destroyed us. The damage do the uh, people do ridiculous damage. Hey, one, two, three, uh, four, five, six. Uh, thanks for the sub. Welcome to the stream. Can we change? Okay, it's L two to change target. That's a bit weird. Oh, uh, can we not die at fucking souls are right there? And we're out of. Oh god, we. Oh shit, shit. I need those souls back. I want to kill this guy because it seems like he's got a pretty cool fast weapon. Oh my god, a bit too fast. I don't think we're going to get away with this, are we? This guy looks really cool. I want his weapons though. Hopefully, if oh shit, stamina management. Probably going to die. I'm like one hit away from dying here. No. Oh. oh, that was lucky. Oh, chill, dude. Right. Can we get his weapon? Nice, nice. Yasuki Butterfly. Let's try those out. Oh, okay, and we got the uh, schematic for the Rhino Arm, which is the other class. Uh, how many YouTube viewers? Um, 91 at the moment. I guess it's because most of my uh, followers are on YouTube, so that's why there's uh, a lot more on YouTube than on Twitch. Um, right, what one do we get? We got... We got... Thing is, though, this this isn't going to get the proficiency scaling, I don't think, anyway. Uh, One-handed, twin-rigged. <clears throat> so we have to start over with the uh, proficiency. <clears throat> the... the um, 
No, uh, it doesn't feel as clunky and slow as uh, Lords of the Fallen, which is definitely uh, the best part about it. It feels more like Bloodborne at the uh, time of dodging. Very uh, fast and slick. The equivalent to bonfires are med bays. Uh, we've only seen one so far, but we've got like two shortcuts back, so... <coughs> okay, code veins don't come out until 2009. Okay. Yeah, this is the full version. This is not the demo. Yeah, I want to see what these weapons can do. We're like, oh, we actually got a potion. Nice. Oh, wait, is this a... Oh, this seems familiar. This is like where the optional boss was, right? Hmm. Right. Um, see if we can get another shortcut or something. This definitely seems like it could be a shortcut. Fuck. Okay, good job we unlocked that. <clears throat> oh, we're not really undead. It's pretty much that we was uh, somebody that couldn't walk. And there was this uh, company that um, was pretty... Oh, wait. Oh, nice. That shortcut. That sneaky shortcut. And there's a company that kind of... Uh, a robotic company. Uh, feel, seems pretty dodgy company, but thanks to it, he's got an exosuit and he can walk now. Uh, but it seems like pretty much uh, the robots have taken over the world. It's hard to tell, to be honest. It's, it comes out the 16th, yeah. This is just a review copy. <coughs> uh, no, I'm definitely not the only one that got a copy in the world, no. There's actually quite a few. Well, I'm not sure how many, but there's a few people at least streaming it. Right. You won't see any reviews up uh, yet, though. Because you're not really allowed to upload reviews yet. Right, so we're actually level 17, which is pretty nice. Um, and I believe... Yeah, so we unlocked a, another implant uh, slot for being level 15. But so far we can't equip any of these, which I'm not really too sure why. So I'm guessing these are just like buffs, maybe? I'm not too sure. Um, yeah, I don't think there's like a humanity form or anything like that in this game. <coughs> right, so let's see if we can build something. Um, we need a body. We, I think we need to chop off a few people's bodies to get this, though. How you do that from being a YouTuber? Well, technically, all you have to do is um, ask for it from the publishers it's pretty much that simple if you can get hold of their their contact or their email it's as simple as that and if they think that it's worth it then they'll just give it to you oh okay another implant there's some nice things here this this wouldn't actually be a bad hundred percent walkthrough seems pretty sick like the uh optional things are really well hidden right um what did we just pick up an implant so we just picked up a why can't we equip these? Is there a reason for that? Still help them. Change implant at med bay. Oh, okay. So the ones with... Um, the ones with the... Uh, I get it now. So the ones with that little symbol means that you can only swap them at the med bay. Okay, that makes sense. I guess. Um, performing finishing moves, restore health, uh, maximum energy. All right, we're going to go for that one, I think. <clears throat> yeah, I hope I hope the environment changes a bit. Um, it really depends what you're into. Like, if you're into Dark Souls, then I guess this. Horizon's a really good game. Don't get me wrong, but um. Uh, I don't know. It's short-ish, kind of. Uh, yeah, we can do heavy attacks. Well, I'm not with this weapon. It doesn't look like it, actually. No, oh, with this weapon, it seems quite similar. I'd say almost identical. Oh, that combo. How do we do that? Is it R1, R1, R2? Somebody behind me. Same guy. He's back for more. Right, I got your weapon now, matey. I want to do that. Oh, fuck, I'm gonna die. Oh, fuck. Oh, bad spot. I guess this is where the uh, optional boss was. How's this not open? What's this? 
Oh, this is a shortcut to a certain degree anyway. Okay, interesting. So, how do you do that other attack? Is it like this? Nope. Huh. Is it like this? Nope. Weird. How do we do the other attack? Seems interesting. But you can kind of do short. Ah, oh, fucking. <laughs> you can do um heavy attacks. I don't know, I found Horizon kind of shortish. I mean, this first time through it doesn't seem like it. I'm obviously talking without optional missions and stuff like that. But the main quests aren't really that long at all. In my opinion, anyway. Oh, I should have went for his body. We need those body parts. Oh. Backflip move, that'd be pretty cool. Oh, there it is. <laughs> It says R2, R2, R1. Nice. That's pretty sick. Seems like it's quite a few hidden combos. That's pretty cool. Right, we're really bad on health and we don't really have anything to... Okay, I'm nearly dead anyway, don't worry. Everything, everything does so much damage on this game. Pretty sure I'm going to die, I guess. That was lucky. Oh, that was close. I'm not sure. I know we got some uh, some Estus or potions off of some enemies, but I'm not sure how it works exactly. Hmm. Fuck. Well, I look at the chat. Uh, I don't know. It feels a lot more Bloodborne-ish than Lords of the Fallen, in my opinion, anyway. Uh, it's obviously not quite as slick as Bloodborne, but it's definitely faster than, like, some of the Souls games, even. Uh, well, not the devs, the publishers, but yeah. Yeah, it's probably... Yeah, that, I think that's the right word. It's It's kind of clunky. But it's definitely not slow. I I know there was like an alpha version of it, I think, and it it was quite horrible actually. But it's definitely got a lot better for, since then. All right, let's do that backflip attack. See what happens, or not. Oh, okay, we kick him in the face. Nice. Oh, I wanted to do a spin attack. Oh, I don't have enough stamina. Right, um, we go. Let's see if we can run past now. We've got some potions. Well, let's just hope Bloodborne 2 is a thing. It would be really cool if it was. What's this? We didn't go this way in the end, but I'm guessing it takes us near enough to the same place. Uh, yeah, I played um, Neo. I completed Neo. I was actually doing 100% walkthrough on the channel, but I didn't have time to finish it completely, which is a shame. New messages. Okay, what's this? Audio logs, great. Not interested in that. We are asking all employees to remain vigilant. Please, if you see or hear Is there PvP? I don't know. To be honest, I don't know if there's any multiplayer um mechanics in this game. Terrorism is everyone's problem. Trust me, it feels nothing like Lords of the Fallen. I I didn't actually like Lords of the Fallen that much thanks to the uh movement, but uh this is definitely nothing like it. A electric tree over there on Twitch. That's got me. Right, so we're all the way back here. Let's, let's see if we can get some body part. Yeah, we want a body part. Ah, oh, that's pretty beast. All right. Oh no, that's second attack. Oh, that's shit. No stamina. Oh, luckily we can do that. Hey, uh, hey, Mr. Peace. Thanks for dropping by. If you're off, um, I did, um, I did, uh, Bloodborne and Soul Level Four, 
or whatever it's called, but I didn't do the DLC. I think I did some of the optional bosses. I actually honestly can't remember. Oh my god. You can't just tank through enemies on this game by the looks of things. Oh shit, I'm forgetting about my souls. Oh my god. This guy's actually quite tanky, or maybe it's this weapon. The weapon seems really cool, but uh, since I had my uh, proficiency for one-handed, it's probably a better idea to keep the one-handed weapon, actually. So let's go and change back to that. Right. I actually forgot about this shortcut, didn't I? Oh, can you? Okay, how do you do that? Oh, okay. I see how you do it now. Down on the D-pad. Nice. Right, um, so... Oh! Fuck me. This guy, the holy shit. Wow, that damage. Not really any way I can dodge. I'm not in a really bad position to fight this kind of guy. Wow. Okay, that's pretty good. The skills. Well, we're not having much skills at the moment, anyway. Just getting destroyed. Look how much damage they're doing. This is like the first level. Uh, I do have a Patreon, but I don't really use it, to be honest. That's why I'd much prefer people to just donate on the stream, on Super Chat, or even Twitch, because... I don't know, I think it's more interactive. It's definitely been a long time since I've not checked my Patreon page, to be honest. I didn't really like it too much. I'll probably even take it down. But I don't know. Right, mate. Oh, my God. Such a bad fuck. Oh, my God. That's scary. He just doesn't stop. Look at that. Wow. Oh, my God. Uh, you can backstab. At least that's what I know, but I don't. I'm not too sure about shields or parrying because this is literally a blind playthrough for me as well. So, yeah, hard to tell. Stay behind mobs. Mm, is what is it worth the price? I don't know yet. Uh, still on the tutorial. Uh, no, they don't have character creation. What am I doing? Which is a bit of a shame. Alright, um, let's go. Let's go. Oh, I wanted to go through him, but it's not an option. This guy's so quick, though. I think, is this the same guy as where I, what the, where I got the weapons from, I guess, but just from a different direction? Yeah, take that, motherfucker. Oh, that's close. So much damage he's just done there. Right, so I'm not really sure where we got to go, because we're back here again. Oh. It's like you can't really um, like knock them back as much as on Dark Souls. It's like they've got a lot of poise on this game, or at least that's what it looks like. Uh, NPC Phantoms? Uh, I'm not sure what you're talking about. I don't think so. Uh, I'm not sure if I should be down here. I'm not even sure where I am at the moment. Yeah. Um, oh, okay, I see what you mean, yeah. I, I knew they were unprotected, but of course, you're right. Uh, they, they don't actually drop anything if they're unprotected, so yeah. Uh, well, we're not done the Soul Level 1. We did beat the uh, Soul of Cinder, though. But I will be continuing to do the optional bosses. We actually already beat um, Osir Osiris. So yeah, so we've got a lot of optional bosses to do and the DLCs. Oh, it's so weird having L2 to change our target. Not too 
pretty sure how we get um okay this guy's got a defense body that means we can actually get a body part from him right okay so yeah so depending what part we take out they'll give you upgrade materials for that part of the body but obviously if they're unprotected then they just won't give you anything so we got a new implant but we don't really have any lights to go down here so it's probably not a good idea we need a body part for that the game sounds quite low Should I? okay i'll boost it up a bit though there's not really much going on in the game to be honest like there's not actually really much sound going on this is all the way back. So we've actually opened up a load of shortcuts. Oh shit, how do I... I'm blocking half the screen with the other screen, but... Right, I'm not sure where we gotta go. Should we try and take out this other guy again? Though we're... No, stupid. We don't have any uh, items or potions or anything. All right, let's go and see if we can level up. Safety risk detected. What? I'm not going to take. By. Oh, seriously? Fuck oh, off. We're going to die here. Or well, at least if we die here, we're pretty close to it. Is that good enough? Oh, no, not. Okay, camera's going a bit wild. Please stand by. Okay, there we go. Welcome, Warren. A bit happy. <laughs> right, med bay. Uh, right, uh, let's see if we can. I don't think we can, but build the body part. Oh yeah, we can. We actually can. If <clears throat> right, so we need some more scrap to uh, build the body part. So I guess we're just gonna farm that a bit. I guess. Uh, is this guy's body protected? Is this the body? Right arm, left arm, body protected. Nice. Would you PvP today? Maybe. It depends if I can stream at night or not. I'm not too sure yet. Right, that's a body part. I'm not sure how many. I think, is it just one at a time? Yeah. Oh, but no, what am I talking about? We don't need body parts, do we? We need, uh... We just need the scrap, so... Oh, get destroyed. That's pretty nice of a there. Ah, oh, you bitch. Right, um... Yeah, I know. I just uh, used all those uh, souls of... I know what you mean. But yeah, I just used them all. But it didn't... It, it, they seem like it hardly gives you anything, so... But yeah, we did use them. But what I'm thinking... Oh, fuck. Oh, an idiot. Oh, it didn't count. Okay, good job. Oh, fucking... I nearly used them to level up there. That would have been really bad. Take care. It actually seems like we got... No way. How much scrap do we have? Do we have a thousand? Oh, that's pretty nice. And why does it say at the bottom right? 200. Hmm, weird. Oh, okay, I see. Oh, so we didn't use them. I thought I did, my bad. You're right, I didn't use them. We still need 600 more. Have a nice day, Warren. What did I just do? Did I just lose them all? What the fuck? This is not a scheduled break time. Oh, okay, I did bank it. Oh, do you? Oh, so you bank it as in it stays here so you can't lose it? That's pretty cool. Though I'm guessing that then you can't use it to level up. It, you can only use it for that. Yeah, okay, yeah. I just noticed that. That's pretty cool, actually. I didn't realize that. I thought banking was just... Uh... Okay. So that means that... That... Yeah, you're, you're right then, Tony. I haven't been using... These... Um... I don't think so, anyway. I haven't been using, or have I? I'm not sure. 
Oh, I haven't been using them then. Okay. That's pretty good. I, I thought, what I thought is when you went into here and then you press triangle to bank, I thought you just automatically used all of uh, these things just to help you out. But obviously that's not the case. Okay. Okay. It's pretty neat, actually. Okay, that'll do. Right, so let's build this body part then. Nice. So obviously, as you can see here, we can actually... How do you upgrade it? There was a way to upgrade. Yeah, so like you can upgrade it all the way to Mark IV. But obviously, we need a lot more pieces. So, let's, um, let's use some of this to level up then. Okay, so uh, that's weird. I thought banking just mean, meant just use all these automatically. Probably not. At least you can use them pretty fast. Okay. We're level 21 already, and we're still not like, in the first level. Right, let's see if. I'm not really too sure to, where to go at the moment. Um, let's see if there's another door or something. Did I, I didn't equip my body part, did I? I need to do that. Let's see if maybe we have to go down bottom. Body gear. There we go. Okay. Maybe we look a bit more. Huh. Am I? I don't think. Is, is there actually a way uh, on this game? I don't think so. I could be wrong, though. I'm not too sure if there's like a. A weight um, penalty on this game. Should we, should we try and take this guy out one more time? Fuck me. Such bad positioning. Probably a bad idea then. Oh, okay, so there's weight. I'm gonna have to look at that then. I, f I did feel like I was dodging slightly less, maybe. I don't know. Stamina consumption. Where does it say that though? Is it stability, maybe? I don't know. Or I take it maybe like the stamina consumption means how much stamina it uses to dodge. I'm not too sure. Yeah, most of his attacks definitely seem one shot at least. Don't really want to go this way because of this. Point. I'm just going to see if we can go to that dark place. Can you get out of that thing? There we go. Right, um, let's go to the. Where was that dark place? It was around here somewhere. It's down here. Hopefully, these guys ain't all gonna follow us. Okay, we got some light. That's good. See what's down here then. Bloody hell, that is dark. That is very dark. Uh, any way to heal, yeah, very similar to Dark Souls, uh, you have a set amount of, kind of Estus potions, as you can see, to the bottom right of my health bar, but you can get more. We've got three at the moment.
but God knows they will care if the media gets hold of it. Okay. Yeah, I knew we could jump, but just it's a really weird jump, I guess. But thanks for finding that out anyway. Right, going deeper. What does this even look like without lights? Yeah, pretty unplayable, I'd say. Right. Oh, 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 that's cool. Do seem to oh crap. Do you seem to get some like uh, potions from some of the enemies, but I'm not sure how. Or is it just like random kind of like Dark Souls Esther's charges? We have come into possession of evidence that links Ed Nakana, employee number seven seven six nine one zero, to the homicides associated with the individual. Oh yeah, it's sure. Have this little punk the young Right, I'm glad you don't have to like actually Therefore, stop to heal it just happens while he's at large he is a serious threat to staff and Creo's image if this were to get out we need to take mm. care of this quickly and quietly so dark my god Oh, I keep forgetting about our souls or whatever. Well, I'm not even sure. Oh, yeah, they're at the optional boss, aren't they? Huh. The light only point downwards. What do you mean? Like when we're moving, it does. Oh, I see what you mean. Can we aim it? I don't think so. No. Oh, hello. How do we do that? We just done like a weird little jump there. Hmm. Weird. I don't know what happened there. Oh no! Not one of these guys. These guys destroy me. I don't even have any potions left. So greedy. How many types of weapons? Well, I'm not actually sure. I've seen three types of weapons so far. Uh, there's heavy weapons, there's these single handed weapons, and this, uh, like, dual kind of daggers, which was kind of like what that guy was using right there. Come back anytime. Is there a faster way to get to that place? In this place is it? No, this is the same place as before. How do we lose health? Does that does that actually poison me? Yeah, I think I did see it somewhere, but I think it's like two or three one. Right Where was the proficiencies? So in this menu, specs, I think maybe. Okay, yeah, so we've got single rig, twin rig, one handed staff, and heavy duty. So it's five in total. Five different types of weapons. Yeah, I'm not i I'm not too sure how how uh, cl uh weapons in the same class vary. So Go back down here then, I guess. There must be a boss soon. I mean, come on. It's like, we've not fought a boss yet. Went wrong way, I think. Alright, we died down here. So. Totally nothing's going to follow us. The damage is absolutely absurd. So. Um, they are very. It's very similar to Dark Souls in a lot of aspects. 
Implant acquired. Okay. Yeah, these like more. I don't know, maybe more potions or something. Right. Well, I'm not sure about priority soon. Like to be honest, this is only the first level. Do we, oh, we just got energy. Nice. Doesn't really help us in a lot of ways. Though. Okay, so... Okay, okay, I see what you mean, I think. Are right, we gonna be able to open one of these doors or something now? We've not got any headgear, so let's try and knock his head off. I could already be able to do one, I'm not too sure. I haven't even tried doing head pieces yet. This door just open? No, we came through here. So this door won't open then? Yep. Oh, we can go further down, I see. Hope, like, I hope if the boss is down here, there's, there's gotta be a shortcut. Because the boss is probably... Fuck me. The boss is probably gonna insta- Oh, right, we've been here before, actually. That range, though. Holy, where am I going? Oh, fuck, I'm gonna run for it if you don't mind, guys. Help. Let me DP a shortcut? I really don't know if that's a shortcut or not. <laughs> Are we at an entrance or...? Yeah, this is this the same entrance? I think there's different entrance though. But I don't think it's advancing much though. I think we could have came down here anyway. I don't know. Okay, so... Huh. <laughs> Where is, where is the boss then? Where is the boss? Let's go back to the, uh, let's go back to the bonfire of the med bay anyway. Uh, this is the full game. Oh, seriously guys, let me know. Lockdown in effect. You can huff and you can pass. I'm gonna die, I think, yeah. Renewable energy. Oh, okay, so I'm guessing there's like some doors or something I can open now. Okay, Nightmare Terror, thanks for dropping by anyway, mate. See you later. Look out for your fellow workers. They look out for you. Yeah, the enemies on this game, definitely, at least at the start, definitely seem to do a lot more damage than stuff like Dark Souls. Oh, we don't have enough. Well, can we make a headpiece? Yes, we can. Nice. Do we make it? I'm not sure if we made it. Uh, I don't think so. Okay. We're not going full side. <laughs> we look like Soldier 76 here. Day one now. That'd be good. Workers. They look out for you. Right, so you reckon now we can fight the boss on the surface. But where's the boss? That's the question. Reboot in progress. 
Oh wait, what the fuck's going on? Oh, hello, is this the boss? Is this the actual boss? Yeah, it seems to be. Right, boss battle time. This is going to be interesting. Can we damage it? Probably a bit too early. But... Oh, this is actually a boss, we, so he gets his own boss damage and everything. I wonder how much damage it does to it. Okay, quite a lot. At least it didn't one shot it. Oh, that was close. I don't, I'm not too sure what that bottom bar is that's uh, charging up. Uh, oh, oh wow, that was fast. I didn't really get time to react to that, mate. We're not really doing any damage, though. Maybe we got to like, cut off his legs or something first. I guess I'm gonna pull that uh, orange bar up first. I oh, can't appreciate it to, to not die before even seeing what the orange bar does. Okay. Okay, we can actually do damage. So we've got to pull the bar up to like overheat, I guess. And then we can attack it. Doing massive damage here, though. Well, at least there's a pretty slow boss, I'd say. Except that one attack he did that oh that was that was bloody fast. I think we probably need a stronger weapon for this. Maybe upgrade the weapon or something. Unless bosses are really meant to take this long. Oh, oh that was close. Him, except he does a massive explosion uh, before. Oh, okay. This or near? That is a very hard choice. I've got to say, it depends really what game you like. Like, if you like uh, Dark Souls, then I think this is more like Dark Souls, and it's not too bad, or at least what I've seen so far. But uh, if you like games like Final Fantasy, then I'm guessing Nia is the way to go. Oh, he launched a rocket barrage at me? Okay. <laughs> it's not my fault I'm tickling him, am I? Is it? Electric Tree, thanks for the uh, follow on um, Twitch. I'm noticing my face cam is extremely white at the moment. I don't know why. I'm not sure why the white balance. Yeah, that's a bit better. I don't know why the white balance keeps just resetting itself. Optimus Prime. <laughs> that is kind of true, I guess. The 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 um, face thing looks quite similar to Soldier Seventy Six from Overwatch. Right. Um. Hey, Gashwell, Thanks for the follow over on Twitch. Oh look, we even got kind of like a fog gate. That's pretty cool. That is, that's cool. That is. Right, probably. I should have checked if I can upgrade my weapon or something. We're really not doing much damage. Here. Oh, that damage. Damage is what I think. Oh, it's not too bad for a boss, I guess, but it's just so fast. I can't really predict where it's coming from. S 
stamina. Right, so we gotta be careful before he lets us attack him because he'll rocket or barrage us. Okay, now we gotta watch out for this. Oh shit, I didn't see that one coming. Okay, that's still coming. Okay, fine. Uh, hey Cash World on Twitch. Uh, this isn't really, well, it's not early access, it's just a review copy of the full game. And to be honest, you just have to get in contact with the publishers. And if they think that uh, you're worthy, I guess, then they'll give it to you. Yes, this is very Dead Space-ish. Like, especially like the armor set and stuff like that. But yeah, let, let's go and let's go and see what we've got. I'm guessing we've got like a lot of uh, new kind of things that we should equip. Um, hey Steven, so I'm playing it on PS4, but this does exist. Well, it will exist uh, for um, PC, and I don't think it's got PvP. If I'm not mistaken, I could be wrong though. He's in Magic over on uh, Twitch. Uh, yeah, I'm liking it. Quite a lot so far. Definitely more than Lords of the Fallen. It's got a nice feel to it so far anyway. Probably not as, obviously not as great as Dark Souls, but it's still a very nice feeling. It's like fast, it's not as sluggish uh, as uh, Lords of the Fallen. Uh, okay, so no, there's no PvP. Thanks for confirming that anyway. So, where, can we upgrade our weapons? or Yeah, upgrade weapons, right. So we just need a bit more scrap. Let's go and see if we've got some scrap. No, we don't. All right, let's go and get a bit more scrap to upgrade our weapon. Then we'll also Happy put the help. other implants on. A bit more scrap to upgrade the weapon, we should be good. It's quite hard to backstab, it's like you need to be a lot more precise to backstab. I don't think PvP is a thing from what I've heard, but I could be wrong. I think maybe kill one or two more enemies, and it's nice. Yeah, there, there's executions. Um, so basically, uh, you have to weaken. You can like aim at different parts of the body. So maybe like we want a headpiece to craft the headpiece, and we got to aim at it. And then once it's about to die, you just go to square, and you'll cut that part off. And if you do it correctly, then you can pick the part uh, that you cut off. I can see, oh fuck, yeah, we just got a, a, a wrecked uh, Link's head gear. Fuck, I'm gonna die. Fighting two enemies on this game at the same time is fucking hard. Okay. Should have enough. Oh, we got the one-handed up to level seven, but I'm not sure how much. How, does this stack that well or not? Medium. Okay, we're still the best we've got. Hello. Right. So let's. See if we can upgrade our weapon. Yeah, we can upgrade it now. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Right. Let's see what implants um, we've got. So, slows energy decay, increase the amount of energy gain. Let's take this off. 
So this uses energy to restore health. Maximum health. Skills with core power. Let's get that. And let's swap this with mission moves. Okay, let's let's uh, equip another load of esters or whatever or potions. So now we've got six. That's pretty nice. <coughs> uh, I'm not sure about the new game plus feature. To be honest, not got a clue. Like like I said, this is literally my blind um first blind playthrough as well. So we're still on the first boss. So this is like the first time I'm playing it as well. Have a nice day, Warren. Uh, right, let's see if with this upgraded weapon and more esters or more potions we can go and beat this first boss. Hey Sven, how's it going mate? Welcome to the live stream. Let's see if we can go and kill this first boss with our upgraded weapon now. Let's see if we do how much more damage we do. Okay, so, wow, that's actually quite a nice upgrade, not gonna lie. Oh, have we been through here before? No, it's an audio logo. Great news, guys. We finally got the new gear assembly unit down here. And not a moment too soon. The old one was spitting out worse trash than what you put in. For now, though, you'll have to manually unlock the schematics on your local accounts, at least until they update the interface. The All right, first boss. Let's let's usual. go. You know, pick what you need. Make sure you got the proper materials and hit OK. So hopefully we should do. Yeah, we definitely fill it up a lot faster now. I should probably be careful with my stamina though. Ah, oh, the stamp. Holy. Wow. I even upgraded my bloody max health. That's pretty brutal. At least, they look out for you. at least it's not too far away, anyway. <laughs> Dead Rising. I guess I can see. I I can see why you're saying that. Yeah, we got it. that upgrade is actually very nice. I don't think there's. I don't think there's online. Right. Got to watch out for that stump. So we got to keep an eye on our stamina. Get our uh, souls back. Patience is by far the key to these weapon um, these kind of games. I also gotta watch out for that rocket barrage. Oh, there it is. Shit, I thought he wasn't dead yet. Oh, you should be able to hit him now. Okay, we are doing some nice kind of damage. Well, I think we missed a few seconds, but. Oh, so this is a good game to do a soul level 1 playthrough? That would be pretty cool. Well, obviously, depending on how good the game is, it's going to be boring. Then. We'll try the optional boss once we defeat this guy. We nearly beat him once, but he did one shot. It. But I think with this damage, we'll get him down a lot quicker. I've got to watch out for these rocket okay. Okay. Oh, does he not go down? More rockets? 
Maybe does it twice and then go down, maybe. Or not, okay, maybe not. Fuck you, don't go down then. Because we can't even damage him. Now. How do we get him down again? Fuck, you know. Do you mind going down, or...? Is it? Is it? Yeah, it's passed definitely to the top. Weird. Do I have to do something specific? Or maybe just survive until we dust it? That would be a bit... Oh my god. Still can't damage you. Oh, nearly land on top of me there. Oh, he goes down if the rockets hit him. Oh, that's pretty cool. So we got way into the rockets here. Oh, that's, that's sneaky. That's pretty clever. Right? That's that's cool. Oh, I know stamina, man. I really need more stamina. Wow. Probably not gonna do it now. Wasted too much time. That mechanic's actually pretty cool. Fuck. Oh, that's close. Alright, I think he's gone down this time anyway. Oh, we're doing loads of damage now. Is he dead? No. Oh no, shit. Ah, oh, so fast those attacks. Nearly had him there. Yeah, that is true. Seems like quite an interesting first boss. So close. Alright. I, I think if I would have known about the uh, the rocket mechanic, then I would have had him then. Could have been sat there for a long time, if not. I don't, like, if one thing's true, it doesn't seem like they've been, like, lazy about it. Like, having mechanics like that in the first boss is pretty good. Like, they didn't just slap in as a, like, generic kind of boss. Fuck. Stamina. Holy. Oh, I'm on top of okay. Oh, he tries doing some combos. Probably not the best time to look at the chat. Oh shit, that could have been dangerous. Is he done? I mean, is he full? Yeah, he's full. Yeah, he hit himself already, I think. We can't do like a uh, execution on this guy, don't we? And now, this time when he goes down, he should be dead. Shit, I think our souls were like right next to us and we didn't pick up. Hopefully we didn't have too many. Oh, 
kill me at 700. Okay, I think it should die now. Potions left. Evaluating I think the best thing we can do is like stay behind his legs and just dodge that. Do such a great job. Oh, what? Can you go missiles or? Yeah. Where am I meant to be hitting him? Okay, yeah. Sometimes it doesn't seem like he's doing damage, that's bullshit. Well, it's probably gonna not turn out too well. Uh, yeah, we did beat the Soul of Cinder, and uh, we will continue doing the optional bosses and the DLC. Okay, so try vertical swings. Okay. Be careful uh. out there. Okay, Mr. Peace, we'll see you later. Thanks for dropping by. Um, I think we was locked on. I could be wrong though, I'm not even sure. I think it's like one of those things that's so passive that I'm not sure. I think we was locked on anyway. Right. So when he goes down, we'll try more vertical attacks. Oh, I hate that attack. No, see that one. Evaluating tactical options. I thought it was down. Subjugation So I think if we just stand below him then that's safe. I think if we hit him in this like little engine thing, it may do more damage. Functional. Oh shit. What was that? Oh, fucking idiot, so greedy. Only got two bloody potions left, that's sick. Stand underneath. Damage is pretty nice. Ah, oh, when you get hit by one of those, you're gonna get hit by the second one. Restricted area, error, system failure. Okay, hit down. Can we kill him? Yes, nice.
Hey Mad Craze the Blaze. Welcome to the stream, man. So I look like <coughs> I look like you was expecting. Okay. I think you're the first person to actually say that. Right, so we got our one handed weapon up, uh to plus A or whatever it is. And where do we go now? Do we do we just continue I guess? Okay. Hey Jazz, thanks. Where do we go? Do we continue this way? I, though we've already been here. This weapon upgrade is like so noticeable, it's not even funny. So where do we go from here? See up here? There was a locked door up here, but I think... Okay, it's open. Nice. Is this like an elevator, maybe? Okay. So it looks like the first level has been done. Nice. Uh, this is the full game. Alright, where are we? This looks like the factory itself. Jump in so weird. Uh, I'm not really sure about the law. I mean, at the start, you pretty much just see that uh, this company, uh, Creo, is kind of a robotic company, and they they wanted to build the world or take the world back to its former glory and all that. But obviously, something went wrong, and uh, I'm not quite sure what yet. But everybody's, all the robots are kind of went a bit mental. Oh, drone registration. So I think this is like the ranged combat. Um, no, it isn't a PS4 exclusive. This is on PS4 at the moment, but uh, you can also buy for PC and I even believe Xbox One. Need the Lano Brink. Welcome. I think you. I'm not sure if she was here before. Now, right. Um. Let me show you so I believe the drone's kind of like the only ranged attack you get on on this game. Right. So where is everybody? Unable to initiate link to Creo Net. No data available. Fabulous. Then where's operations? Information unavailable. Seems you've got a screw loose somewhere. Thanks for your concern. <laughs> Error. Okay. No loose screws found. Fucking <laughs> idiot. Time to right, get to um, work. Terms of use and license agreement. What are you on about? How may I be of service? Uh, provided by Cleo. I'd like to help. I'm pretty sure this guy's meant to come along with me. I'd like to. Please hold the line. Form unique combat actions, let drone modules to expand its arsenal, okay. Drone. Drone modules. Uh, ranged attack, energy consumption tool. 18, bloody hell. How do we use it though? So does it maybe fire automatically? I don't know, we'll see. Hey old school gamer thirty four open uh Twitch. Yeah, it, the the combat's quite souls like. It's definitely more souls like than uh Lords of the Fallen. And it may even be closer to Bloodborne, just the way you like uh sidestep so fast. It's probably a bit more clunky, but it's still very like it's nowhere near as clunky and slow as Lords of the Fallen. Oh, it's an execution, okay. But what's triangle do? What's okay? So we'll, we'll look into that. So we can use it for triangle, maybe. 
becomes more useful over time. Look out for drone modules to teach you new tricks. Oh, I see. So once we've got like that that far on the energy bar, if we press triangle, I guess it uses it, right? Yeah, because we can't use it, so it's not enough energy. So yeah, obviously, I'm guessing once the bar, the blue bar, gets up to that point with the little drone well, sign on it, then you can just use it with triangle. Is currently running on emergency Seems power. legit. Services are limited at the moment. We apologize for any inconvenience. Oh wow, wow, wait, wait. Oh look at that hammer, I want that hammer. They're not going for the fast kind of Right, what what arms you got that hammer in? That one. I think anyway. Yeah. This weapon does so much damage now about grade it's not even funny. Can we get that weapon? Did we get that weapon? Nice. So it's, it looks like a hammer, right? Is it this? No, it's this. Where do we get this from? Where the hell do we get this from? Oh, we got this off of the boss. Okay. Let's see what this is. So. Oh, this is actually rigged. So this isn't like a heavy duty weapon, but this one is. Obviously. Oh, look how slow we are. Okay, now this feels like Lords of the Fallen. <laughs> Nice. Okay, let, let's try it out for a bit. Though we haven't got our proficiency up at all, but still. Let's jump down here. See what they're turning. Hey, you! Over what is this? This is this a lift? Maybe a shortcut? Oh no, this is a. Okay. Uh, they're not parries, they're like uh, execution, so when you get them down to low health and your blue bar is past that little like saw icon, that means you can press square and do an execution. <coughs> oh, are you a good guy? Guess you've got no idea what's going on around here. Shit, man, I don't know. <laughs> Nobody you know, like knows my anything. Brain was an egg on a griddle and the yolk popped. Woke up, head ringing like crazy. Everything had just gone to hell. Wanted to check the failsafe consoles, see what they were. Got separated from my crew, but I thought, Hobbs, don't give up now. And that's when my re. Okay. Okay, then. See you around. Well, that wasn't like compared to our upgraded weapon and our proficiency. This isn't too good. It's really slow for the damage it does. Oh my god! Seeing his doesn't do the same shitty little damage as mine does. See if we can do a combo or something. Okay. Oh, okay. That's a quite a nice combo. How about another combo. Oh, get destroyed. Wow. Okay. Right, we're going to take this weapon off anyway because it's not really doing. There's not enough damage. Plus, it's like 10 times slower. We're doing like pretty much the same amount of damage. I'm guessing if he hits me with his Nitro weapon, then probably going to be screwed. Fuck yeah. <laughs> okay. The damage is not really. Oh right, you can stagger them, that makes sense then. That is true. But I'm guessing if we upgrade it and all that, it'll, I'm guessing it will do some nice damage anyway. Yeah, that was pretty brutal. I mean, the variant weapon seems okay at the moment. Poise. Poise is a bit weird, but at least there is... Like, that exists. Let's just keep it in that. Oh. Right. Um, what way do we go this way? I 
didn't try the drone out yet, actually. Oh. That damage is absolutely berserk, guys. Lockdown in effect. You can huff and you can puff. Please return after the area is secure. All right, go on, drone. See what you got. Threat level elevated. All right, that damage no isn't bad. Okay, it fires like once or twice. We regret to inform oh, this is a med station limited. we missed. Or med bay. Yeah, I just read that, thanks. Hey, King Blue over on Twitter. A uh, Twitter. Twitch. Uh, yeah, this is kind of like Dark Souls in a lot of ways and yeah but it is it's different to dark souls in some other ways but it's very similar especially the combat and stuff like that and the difficulty as you probably noticed right um gear assembly is offline why is that is there a reason for it to be offline okay tony see you in a second Oh, is that me? Good to see. Don't think I found this. Here. Oh, he just gave me a shit ton of things. What's the deal with these fail-safe consoles? Creo's got a few around. Okay, this kind of reminds me of Dark Souls a bit as well. How like you save an NPC and he comes back to a safe area. That's pretty cool. Worst has got to be over now. All right, so we just got a load of uh, scrap and stuff. Um, right. No. Um, see so we got any items to use? No, only one. That's no good. Still can't use it though. Please remember, safety at work is our highest priority and should be yours. I thought it was dead then. Oh, that's a nice little secret. Like that, I really like that. That's like really dark soulish. And a lot of alloys lately was pretty cool. Neat little secret area down there. Um, where was we coming from? So this unit is not okay, fully. Okay, we're going down here. I think yeah. It's this guy. This guy can literally just destroy us in two hits. Go on, drone. Please return at threat level elevated. I'm not sure how long, the, if the drone always lasts that long, or maybe if we've got some more elevated. stamina or energy no bar, the drone, like, time. uses it up. And maybe lasts longer. Or maybe not. I don't know. I think it always just does, like, two shots for now Welcome. until we upgrade it. Due to a power outage, we are unable to provide full service at Can we already this do this, or do we have to do it again? Can't go down here yet. A security lapse has been recorded on floor G. This unit remains disabled. Yeah, I know that. His armor set looks pretty nice though. We'll do more shots now or? Mm, don't think so. I think it always does the same amount of shots. Anyway. Yeah, I think we do upgrade the drone a bit later on. Yeah. Okay, whatever that was. Um, more text. Okay. All oh, right, that was. What's? Oh, that oh, was ass. Okay. <laughs> Idiot. This must have been the guy who killed us last time. So there's actually two ways to get here. Oh crap! There's more than one of them. Oh, I remember this actually. Oh my god, how many? I think one was enough to kill me. I know three of them. Wow, that's ridiculous. Three people. I didn't even kill one of them.
We lost 3,000 tech here. We, we almost just, just wasting time there. Go, I'm sorry, mate, but I'm going to go and get my tech, if you don't mind. So it's down here. Is this it? You need to be like level 75 to be down here. So I'm guessing the world interconnects quite well. Um, if we can come oh my God, down here. Oh, okay, okay. The, the animations feel pretty smooth compared to like stuff like Lords of the Fallen. I mean, not as smooth as Bloodborne, but it feels very similar sometimes. Damage is ridiculous. Like, I thought I was actually quite a high level. Like, I'm level 20 or something like that. And we're like only beat one boss. But that damage. Yep, the damage is pretty absurd. Can only get my bloody stuff. I'm not sure we should go down there again. Like, should, we, should we try and like get one at a time maybe? Okay, take that back. No chance. Absolutely no chance. Where the hell do I even have to go? Probably going the right way, right? If this guy's on his own, we'll take him out. But if it's always something shooting at me as well. Oh, that is unfair. One HP and one stamina? What? <laughs> Could you even roll with one stamina? I think solo one's hard enough for me. Please remember, safety at work is our highest priority oh, and should be yours. I'm gonna lose so many bloody uh tech scrap here, it's not even gonna be funny. Oh no. Oh, that was so lucky. Like, if this was happening in Dark Souls, I'd be like, I'm not supposed to be here. The damage is... Oh, that was close. Oh, they're just going to keep coming, don't they? I want to fight someone with him. But, they just... This guy's got a gun, right? Not happening. can't roll that is that must be just ridiculous so it's pretty much like I'm guessing even one attack well yeah obviously you can only do one attack with one eight one stamina that's be careful out there <laughs> there must be some way really fucking like even just to take out a normal enemy you pretty much just have to parry them I guess oh fuck. one day that's gonna kill me Should probably just take it easy and kill everybody one at a time, but I can't do that because my bloody loads of scraps down here. This guy's got a gun, I want that gun. Can we have a one oh my god, there's so many enemies, what the fuck? Can we just have a one on one, please? That'd be nice. Oh shit, is this bad? This is probably bad. Okay, not too bad. Huh. A bit lost though, I'm not gonna lie. Is this is this the gun? I'm not sure. I'm really getting a bit lost here, I'm not really sure what way I'm gonna be going. Okay, let's go this way. Oh shit, I can't see that guy. That guy's camouflaged so well. Can we just go through that? Oh, it's broken. Right, let's take this guy. Right, I, li I like how they make you fight these guys with the claws. Always in these very fucking thin, thin places.
probably yeah. No, I'm not, um, we got Rhino right now. Okay. <sighs> right. Where are we? We kind of really lost at the moment. Oh, I know where we are. This is the med bay. Nice. Finally, a bit of a shortcut. Good to see you. We can level up quite a lot here. I'm glad we got those uh those thingies back. Scraps. Right, let's consume some of this. That actually, that actually gave me quite a lot. Is this still one? Oh, we can use it now. Hmm. Fuck. Probably shouldn't have wasted so much though. What would it take to upgrade this again? Oh, okay. So. With a few more uh, scrap shard thingies, we can actually upgrade Please the remember, weapon again. Safety at work and I'm quite, I'm quite happy with the damage at the moment, so more damage yours. is just great. Oh my eyes, it's in so much. Allergy. <sighs> Alright, so let's uh, continue down anyway. Right. Oh. Itchy eye now, bad timing. God damn it. Not this guy again. Oh, I got oh, fucks. Oh. oh, my eye is so itchy at the moment. Already allergy or something. Right. You gonna let me play, I or? Oh my god. This is useless. What is that? That's not cool. What the hell did I chop you up for? Is this is this this the good guy, right? Damn it! Hey. Oh, it's another good guy. Okay. You one of these psychos. Already run into a dog. Guess I've always attracted the wrong type of guy. Hmm. Well, I don't know what that says about me, because they've been chasing my ass around, too. <laughs> First time I've smiled in days. Thank you. I'm Irina, trained at... Well, at least it, it seems like there's going to be more NPCs and good guys in this game yeah. than Dark Souls, anyway. I can't... Well, at least you're honest. Which is more than I can say for most men in my life. And I didn't... Got any Uncle idea Flash. <laughs> yeah, guess I didn't, at least... I could uh, I never it's time. Right, uh, whatever dude. Strong silent type huh? Can we jump? Oh, I'm not sure. That that seems rather jumpy like. Or maybe no, I could be wrong. Unless there's like a passive or something that we can get to jump uh further. Hmm. Still very suspicious, not gonna lie. Or maybe from can we jump over it? Oh, we can, huh? Oh. oh my god. Oh dear. Right, what time is it? It's 9 o'clock. Right, we'll have a few more goes. Come back any time. Alright, um... Just forgot Silver Carry. <laughs> I'm not even sure where we went. Where, where do we go? Oh, there was a shortcut, didn't we? We unlocked a shortcut. The annoying thing about this shortcut, though, is that... Um... There's, like... One of these guys every fucking time. Like, one of those really annoying guys. Where was it? Oh, we're going the wrong way. Down here.
Okay. Like this guy, I'm guessing. Or not. Unless there's like a way to sneak up onto him. Come on, dude. Fuck. Right, um. I don't think we went through here last time, did we? I'm pretty sure we didn't. I would have noticed this. Hello, what do we have here? Not much by the looks of things. Sucks. Oh wait, we've got an audio log. It's been over a day now and nothing. She's not responding when I call. It's getting worse out there. Probably, I could have approached that guy out. fast not far him? too fast. Oh shall we just take it? But is there actually a, a legit way of uh like sneaking? One second. I did see one guy. He he was in a terrible state, but he seemed to know what he was doing. Heading to the executive form. Maybe I should have gone like she suggested. Hey Skilo, uh thanks for the follow there on Twitch. Good job I didn't have any souls, I forget I can't bloody take my time. Right, sorry about that guys. Uh, type parry will fit in this game, you can blow up, yeah. Like, most of it feels like Bloodborne, and maybe a Bloodborne type parry wouldn't be too bad. Oh, do we kill, do we try to kill this, whatever the hell this is? I, oh, we didn't take on the optional boss before, did we? We should have gone back. Wow, okay. At least the world does seem pretty well connected. This guy's got a sad, like, a lot of health. Probably shouldn't be taking on this guy yet. Hard to tell. Or maybe it's because I'm attacking the front of him. Yeah, that's definitely a reason. Okay, it's got a shield on the front. Ask for a vacation. What if I told you you can have one every week? That's right. Um, it is, it's, it's live streaming on both, but I'm not getting it from one place and then live streaming on the other. It should be, I, I think just because Twitch looks better in general on live streams. But it is. I'm still like uploading them to both uh, both places at the same time with the same bit rate and everything. So, but obviously the chat's going to be more active on YouTube because that's where all my followers are. Is this guy bugged or? I'm pretty sure this guy's just bugged. We are damaging him, but well. Oh, okay. Got a sad way of killing him, but we didn't really get it. Well, actually, we got loads of text grab, which is okay. Another one. Special counter attack. Okay, so this seems a bit like parrying. Do we have to block at the exact right time or? Okay, that didn't block that well. Oh, 
Let's say, um, block and then R up or down to evade. Okay, so. Oh, okay, so. Oh, wow, that's not working out there, but we're out of Estus. Probably not the best idea. <laughs> this is not going to go well, especially against one of these guys. Fucking somebody behind me as well. Can you fast travel between med bays? Oh, I'm not sure. I don't think so, though. But the world does seem quite well interconnected. Right. I don't think so. Let's just confirm that anyway. Bro. Mm, don't think we can fast travel. Yeah. I'm not sure. I, so it looks like there are some kind of parry, but I'm not too sure how it works at the moment. Maybe try it on a. Well, there's no enemies around here. We've actually got quite a lot of uh, tech scrap down there. Uh, we can try it on this enemy, though. I guess. So, do we have to, like, jump over or something? Shit, my stamina going going down just for having the shield up. Hmm. Was that a counter attack? I don't think so. Oh, okay. So that yeah, there's probably some attacks that we can't block. Um, what way is it this way? Okay, so it's so you gotta like press it as soon as they're about to attack you. I'm guessing. Can we sneak up on this guy any slower? Okay. He still didn't. Oh, that that may have been a parry. Yeah, I know I blocked it, but um, apparently if you block at the right time, then you get a chance to parry. You'll do something similar to a parry. Let's go and get uh, these souls, or these, uh, this scrap. And get the hell out of here and see if we can go back to that jump. So do it from the top, right? I'm not sure, I think that's going to get me killed a few times, but... Can we not make it over there? Jumping hard, jumping, oh crap. Jumping's hard enough on this game. Ah, oh, okay, so. If this is a bug, this is the second time it's happened. The same enemy. Oh, okay. Oh, it's unbugged? No, maybe not, I don't know. Is it, I'm not even sure, maybe it's not a bug. Maybe these enemies are just like this, but it's weird. But it's weird that it's happened twice with the same enemy, though. Oh, well, we got a load of scrap from him, so that's nice. Right. I don't think we're meant to be doing that jump. Well. Have a 
nice day, Warren. Right. I got like two case bloody scrap stuff around there. Oh crap, fucking hell, I was lucky there. Can we not die against this guy? Can we stop being greedy as well? Ah, oh, you just die in such dumb ways when it's very important, don't you? Fucking idiot. Hey Tony, thanks for the sub. God damn it, man. Take care. Oh my god. Well, there goes 2k, so it's, well, it's not even really that much, but still. Hey Richie. Well, so far, it's pretty cool. You know, it's definitely... Oh, for fuck's sake, stop doing that. It's... The only thing I can say that I don't like at the moment is the environments don't seem to be changing that much. Though we are only in like the second area so that could change. But apart from that it seems like a pretty decent game, pretty solid game with the upgrades and the crafting and stuff like that and the armors. It seems pretty decent. Are these good guys? They seem like good guys still. Okay. It's interesting. Shut up, dude. Oh, sorry, so we can't go down here. Hey, Adam. Thanks for the sub on YouTube. Drops on the human. Oh, okay. Can we actually kill these guys then? Am I meant to kill these? Fuck, I'm killing them. Okay, that's probably not a good idea. I want the weapon though. I want the weapon, mate. If we probably even fucking kill you. It's probably not gonna happen. No, it's definitely not gonna happen. I guess that's what I get for being an idiot. That damage though. Fucking amazing. Come back anytime. I'm actually not meant to be going that way, am I? Hey, one, two, three, six, welcome back. Nah, I was thinking maybe the better way to backstab him was like going up to him fast, but that's not the case. Go on, drone. We really need to upgrade the drone so we actually dust on them. Yeah, let's hope not. Though I don't think we're meant to be going down there anyway. I think we're meant to be going through here. Difficulty is definitely real. That damage, man. That's such a fast attack. Oh, that's, that's an ambush right there. Sneaky little shit. Oh, since we use the drone, we don't have the energy to do a uh, execution. Okay, guys. Um, this has been Burgess. Okay, yeah, so listen cool. up. I don't know if you made it out of recycling. Hammer, you can burst to a rocket launcher. What the hell? Oh my god. But if you can, there's no way I can take so many people out of one. Stay safe. I'll be waiting. We can make it together. I may not be, I'm not sure. Let's try and get his weapon and see if it actually... I don't know. It's hard to tell if it's the same... I think it is the same hammer. Oh, fuck. Let's see. Um... 
I think it was the same hammer. Um, what do you think gameplay? Good as Dark Souls? Maybe not quite as good as Dark Souls, but it's, it's quite good. I mean, it's definitely ten times better than Lords of the Fall and stuff like that. It feels kind of slick, like Bloodborne, like especially the dodges feel very Bloodborne-ish, since you don't roll. Hey Dark Souls Spawn, welcome man. How's it going? No, no, the ambush. Oh, the ambush and hammer guy. Oh, you could be right. I'm not sure. I didn't really look at him. Um, I'm not sure how long you've been gone. One, two, three, six. We beat the first boss. And, uh, yeah, we're just in this second area, which is like a factory. And we're having a quite a bad time here. Like, the people here with the hammers do such ridiculous damage. Let's see if we find some shortcuts. Right, um, huh. Not sure, I haven't got a clue which way we're meant to be going, so. Try going down, I guess. Huh. Oh shit, oh, oh my god. Killed. Oh, we don't have any bloody potions. That's gonna be bad. I'll do it. So I, th I keep thinking it's gonna do like a third attack, but that's not the case with these guys. Or at least hope not, anyway. Yeah, the first boss was pretty cool. Hey Gene Clue Van Dam. I'm glad you enjoyed the walkthroughs. I probably won't, not at this state, we probably won't be doing any more on Dark Souls 3. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're right. I need to look at what blueprints I have for weapons. Oh my. That's ridiculous damage. I need a shortcut, like, right now. That's not a shortcut. That's literally where we was. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. Another one of those? Yeah, right. Two of them. Wow. Couldn't even be one. Oh, what the fuck? Whistle there. Yes. So dead, battery's gonna die as well. That's just fantastic. This has been again. I'm still waiting at the outbound station. I want to try and get to the old bio labs. Hey Adam, how's it going? I'm hoping it's safe. Game is pretty cool so far. But I'm not leaving um, without you. Uh, feel your inject. Oh, nice. So we just got some. Fuck you on about me, Jesus. Oh, good job we just cut those uh, potions there. If not, we would have been dead. This armor looks sick, by the way, the guy, this one. Kind of looks like Halo style. Let's try to get his headpiece anyway. I'm not sure about the weapon, if it's the same or not. Alright, we got his head. Oh, it's called Scarab, okay. Let's see if. Uh, yeah, the weapons do seem the same. Right. Okay, yes, we unlocked the schematic. That's pretty cool. <laughs> the jump animation. <laughs> okay, we're getting that proficiency up a lot. Warning. Canal bridges extending in recycling. Okay, so is that like a big, uh, big shortcut? Or I'm not sure where the canal bridges are, to be exact. Oh, okay. Uh, is that the bridge we're talking about? I don't think so. It could be there. Attention, smelter task reassignment confirmed. I'm really too sure what we're doing at the moment. Go back, I guess. Maybe to where the two secondary bosses were. What about this? Nothing. Hmm. 
go back down. Okay, yeah, that's pretty cool actually, because it just depends on the weapon, so. Do we do anything here? Maybe that door? I don't really want to fight any of you guys right now. Thank you very much. This guy running away. Okay, so I think he like he goes to these things and it upgrades his weapon so he can fire with it. Holy shit, what the fuck was that? I think that weren't him though. That was the other guy. That was that guy. I don't really fancy fighting them. He's got quite a lot of scrap on us. Uh, is that elemental damage? I don't know. I don't think. Well, so far there's not been anyway. But this is actually a blind playthrough, uh, play, blind playthrough for me as well. So there's a lot of things that I need to learn. So. <clears throat> okay. So there might be in the form of electricity. So glad that we got our potions back, jeez. Oh shit, there's two of them, no way. Okay. Alright. I thought it was a good guy, he's not got any armor on, that's weird. Well, we do a lot more damage at least. Alright, let's overcharge this. I'm not really sure what all most of this is doing, but still. Uh, maybe open this door. Uh, I like how there's like little things hidden like that. It's really dark soulish that is. Waste disposal. Probably not the best place to be. Uh, this weapon they've got seems new, I think. Let's find out. Oh my god, that damage is ridiculous. No, it wasn't a new weapon. At least I don't think so, anyway. Yeah, I, I normally the um, okay, an arm gear. Oh, we did get a weapon. Okay. Yeah, normally the the ten power core ones are um stuff you have to do. Right, so what's that weapon? This was it, yeah. Um, this is a single rigged weapon. Still not, not that good. Well, unless it's like really fast or something. Yeah, that is true. At the moment, really all I wanted to upgrade is the weapon again, and we could do that with some more. What are you doing? Sector 12 employees, I, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but unlicensed gambling violates federal and state law. And thus oh, Lee, I, don't, I really don't like fighting those things for some reason. Charges and liability. So, all raging drone events are to be cancelled immediately. Oh, shit, click drones and other company equipment oh, I like these helmets, Don't make me the bad guy here. Oh, shit, I love right a good there. drone fight as much as the next guy, but what we're doing here is too important to risk infractions of this nature. Oh, I don't really want to fight you, mate. I've got my. Right, let's see if we can find a shock. Fucking hell, that's scary. Shortcut would be really nice right now. I've been gone for ages. Oh shit, I thought I was dead then. I think that was actually a new thingy. Whatever. Oh wait, um. So 
So you have to craft specific armor parts if you want to get stuff to upgrade that armor part, yeah. Maybe like say you want his weapon, then you gotta like aim for his weapon arm and then cut it off with the execution. Where am I? Material drop. This rings a bell? Not quite sure where we are, but... It, um, okay. This is actually quite close to the med bay, right? Oh, that was close. Yeah, so this is actually right here, the med bay. Yeah, okay, nice. Shortcut there. Oh, wait, wait. Before doing this, let's go and upgrade our weapon. There we go. Alright, so... Okay, nice. Getting some nice damage out of this weapon. Hey, Jeremy, how's it going? So... It's pretty good so far. It's definitely better than stuff like Lords of the Fallen. Uh, I wouldn't say it's quite on par with Dark Souls. But it's definitely got a lot of the good mechanics nice from Dark Souls day, in this game. Warren. Like the difficulty and the... Oh, fucking hell. See, that's what I mean by difficulty. Look at that damage. Ridiculous. But yeah, it, it seems so far so good. Not that I've played the whole thing. Like, this is literally my first playthrough as well. It's definitely better than Lords of the Fallen. By far. I didn't really like Lords of the Fallen that much myself. But this is like a lot more slicker and it seems a bit more like Bloodborne dodging. The only thing the only thing um, that I'm not quite liking so far is the environments could be a bit better but I don't know. Alright so where do we come from? This way I think. I'm not sure but I think we may have been able to activate that our shortcut a lot earlier. Let's try and get his headpiece again. I should have actually tried to make it, but I didn't. Get wrecked. Alright. Oh, that's sneaky. Oh, we got a weapon? Reinforced pipe. Um, what is this? This is a staff type weapon. So, this is the first staff type weapon I've seen? Well, I guess it's. Staff type weapon. How much damage does this actually have? Quite a l not too much actually. Um, fuck it. It's gonna stay with our newly upgraded weapon anyway. Um, how do I get the game early? Uh, it's, it's just a uh, review copy from the developers. The damage. I don't think it's as, as much of a change as the first time we upgraded it, but it's still better. Right, right, what's this? Rare material. Where do we have to go though? I'm not too sure where we came from. Or, or anything really. Maybe we just have to continue this way. I think Access you can denied. upgrade the base of the exo uh, skeleton. D. I think so, I'm not too sure though. I waited 30 minutes for you yesterday. That's far what do we just do? Did this not open the door? I need those items. But if you can't procure them, I have other sources. It's not going to let us in there again. Just let me know you're okay. That's up. Where does this take us? Don't think we've been here before. I could be wrong though. Hard to tell is under oh fuck. Okay, we've definitely been here. Damage though, holy. Yeah, well it really depends what kind of game you you're into. Oh wait, we just got oh that helmet looks pretty sick as well. And quite a lot of cool looking helmets. Not too sure what way I came from. I'm not giving up on you. 
I won't hear it said that Benjamin Burke let down his team. I'm not really sure what our objective is at the moment. Oh wait, this is, yeah, that's what it seems like. It's possible. Oh, that's not good. No, no bloody potions left or anything. Holy shit, that damage. That's not gonna last. That's not gonna last that long. Um, how long are we in the game? This is going to be the second boss. And we've been streaming for about three hours now. And I'm going to have to go very soon. Right. I'll give the boss one more go and I think we'll call it a stream because... Okay, where was that shortcut? Um, no, the game releases in about four days if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, you know, if you're if you're really into Dark Souls and want in another Dark Souls type game, then why not? You know? Oh, I didn't notice that actually. Yeah, that's the thing. The only thing I don't like about it so far is because the settings seem very similar. That's in. Oh wait, what way was? I'm not sure. Was it this way? I don't think it was this way actually. Go up here. I think we went this way. I'm I'm guessing there's probably a faster way to get to the boss, but I'm not sure. Um, we went over here and then we dropped down somewhere. I think. <laughs> Pretty sure we're probably not meant to take damage every time we go down. All right, yeah, the boss was just here. Uh, this is just a review copy from the uh, from the publishers. Does this go outside? Do you mean the world go outside? Like, is there outside parts? Then yeah, the first tall part was outside. Yeah, but it's still very like mechanical. If you go back and watch the stream afterwards, you'll see the first section. I'm not sure what to do against this guy. Anyway. I'm not damaging him at all, am I? Man, is this kind of like the first boss where I have to overheat him or something? Because we're, we're not damaging him at all. Here. There's something we gotta do or something. Or maybe we. Holy! Huh. Maybe I'm not meant to be here. I'm not sure. Uh, it's not a demo, it's, it is the full game. Uh, this is on PS4 at the moment, uh, but it is out for. PC as well and Xbox. How do you get a review copy? Well, just ask for one, really. If you know how to contact the Be careful out there. the publishers, then yeah, obviously then they'll look at your YouTube channel or stream or Twitch, and if you've got enough followers, so then they'll they'll give you one. It's that simple, really. Like, be really they people or companies give out review copies to get the game out there for publicity so if they know that you've got enough followers that it's worth it and that you're going to show enough people their game then they'll give you a review copy All right, um, I'm not sure do we try the boss again I'm not sure if I'm going to go that way actually I want this helmet Um, still didn't do it properly. Right, actually, let's go back. Let's go back and try and get this helmet, and we'll call it a stream. I really, I gotta go now. Uh, all right. Do do do. See if we can get that helmet. Shouldn't you be at your designated work site? <laughs> yeah, it seems like we're doing quite a lot. We're doing nice damage. Okay, so uh we need a bit more um scrap. Okay, that should be enough. I think the blue one gave us two K alone. Okay, nice. So we've got a quite cool looking helmet, if I'm not mistaken. 
Okay, that's that's pretty cool. That's an upgrade. Like now we don't like look like a complete idiot. It'd be cool if we could have the full set. That looks really sick, actually. I'm happy with that. Okay, Gene, no problem, man. Hey, Matt Reagan. Uh yeah, we're we're enjoying it quite a lot so far. It's definitely it's not quite up there with our Dark Souls, but it's definitely better than Lords of the Fallen and stuff like that. Hey, Joe, thanks for the sub. Yeah, this does look pretty good. Um, right, can we make... There's the Rhino. I don't really want the Rhino gear. Can we make this? Fuck it, let's make this. Doesn't really... Oh, it looks pretty cool, cool actually. So can we make another one? Just to go uh, on the other arm, yeah. Nice. Okay, we're getting some upgrades here. Got a cool helmet now, anyway. <laughs> right, so I'm going to call that a day, guys. And, yeah, if I do happen to live stream later tonight, it'll probably be something more chill, like some Overwatch or something. But I'll let you know through Twitter and Discord anyway. So, yeah, guys, thanks for dropping by for the stream. I appreciate all the cool comments and the support. And, yeah, guys, hopefully you are enjoying the game just as much as me. And, uh, yeah, it seems pretty decent. We'll continue streaming this another day. And, yeah, guys, we will see you next stream. Thanks for dropping by, guys.